actually more, more stuff through here. This is a serious haul, boys. Get these uniforms out of here. And turn off those reds and blues, okay? And keep my noise down. This is a decent neighborhood. It's bad enough that the neighbors know there's an illegal ASMR drug down here. We don't need to rub it in. So let's try to keep the attention down to a minimum. All right, get those lights off, get the uniforms out, grab some evidence bags. Let's get this stuff wrapped up. Stevie. Looks like somebody stayed behind and didn't run off with their little friends, is that right? What did you uh, think we'd go easy on you? Think we'd go easy on you, right? You're in a lot of trouble. You're in a lot of trouble. <laughs> I love the setup, by the way. This is the uh, third ASMR drug den that I've busted this week, and I've got to say, this is this is nice. I like it. Disappointing though. I'm sorry. Well, this is just a studio. Oh. Oh really? Just a studio, is it? What do you, what do you do here? Just make make films. Or are you really going to deny what you've been up to in here? <laughs> Looks like we're gonna be here for a wee while, boys. Why don't you go in the next room? I'll take care of this one, alright? Self comfortable. Looks like we're going to be here for a wee while. So, like I said, I've uh, been around the block a few times. Me and the detectives have uh, started to notice certain patterns. Patterns, yeah, with these types of drug dens. <laughs> you can keep denying it all you want. We know what this place is. Have you ever heard of the term an orgy of evidence? Yeah. I mean, it's not quite that bad, but you do have some choice items here. Well, I'm sure they're all perfectly innocent, right? What's this? My paintbrush. There's something very suspicious about this paintbrush though, isn't there? I don't see any paint. Do you? No freshly painted walls, no partially painted anything. And That does seem somewhat dry, as paintbrushes go. I think I know what you have
I've been up to with this. You didn't come daft. Don't you hear come daft? Okay, I don't know what this is all about. Maybe I should demonstrate. these things are for, isn't it? That's why you have them out. Along with all this ASMR paraphernalia. Yeah. You do know how illegal this all is, don't you? That's right. Never really understood the appeal myself. I always stayed away from things that altered your mind, well, within reason, of course. So, I think we can safely say that this is an important piece of evidence. Wouldn't you agree? judge will want to be convinced of your count. And this should help. I've seen these before too. A little stethoscope. Suppose you've been just practicing some medicine, have you, doctor? Yeah. Oh, you're not a doctor. Well, I kind of knew that already. Yeah. So, what's what's this all about then? This is just some hallow part of a Halloween costume. You've been pretending to be a doctor, haven't you? You've been putting, you've been making illegal material for publication on the darkest corners of the interwebs, haven't you? Yeah. You have been making You've been producing material designed to be consumed en masse where you can alter the mental state of countless people all over the world. Many of 
of the younger detectives would look at this and think, well, that's not exactly a smoking gun, is it? But they're not better. And although it might take a little bit of convincing for the judge to explain this, explain it, I most certainly will. very important evidence. Don't lose it. Let's see what else you've got lying around in this completely innocent amazing like I said I know illegal ASMR trickers when I see them and you may have had another detective fooled into believing that these really were just safety pins yeah amazing I mean this is what you do right you make these sounds to try and put people into a trance try to hypnotize them society from people like you okay it's nothing personal we have to do it yeah, we've got a small bag for this one from anyway. These look like the ones you get down in the supermarket. Oh, that is. All right. The judge is fine. All right. Okay. Budget cuts. Shorted. 
shortage of evidence in this place, is there? Thank you, though you've made my job a lot easier than it normally is, leaving all your props. I suppose they are props, aren't they? Leaving all these things out in plain sight. Seems relatively innocent. A little torch. Oh, excuse me. Flashlight. Torch. Flashlight. I call them a torch. You can call it whatever you want. I also call it an illegal ASMR trigger. sounds. I know what you do with these. I mean, it might be the sound. Right. Partly. I know what you do with these. You people into following the light, don't you, doctor? You manipulate people into following the light, don't you, doctor? Don't you, doctor? trance. You then expect them to do your bidding. Very clever. Very sneaky. I know everything that you've been up to. Yes, I have all the information and all the evidence I need to put you away for a long fact, I'll prove it. See this? It's mine. I'm not even going to give that one to the judge. I'm going to keep it for myself. Because I got more than enough. <laughs> I suppose Next, you're going to tell me that this is just for sanitizing your hands, right? That's all, that's all this is. It's just a little bit of innocent hand sanitizer, right? Is that all this is for? Hmm. 
sure that's the case, isn't it? Certainly does feel like hand sanitizer, I'll give you that. say that that's suspiciously stronger than normal hand sanitizer. Have you been drinking that as now? Have you been drinking it? something you also use every day, doctor? What is it? Nurse? Surgeon? <laughs> it's a shame throwing your life away like this. job to do. I have to keep society safe from people like you. Yeah, it's a shame because you know what? In many ways you seem like a very creative individual artist. It's a shame to think that you've wasted all your talents on this. You could have put those talents towards something better, something more productive. Such a waste. in another bag that way we don't have to carry you know what I mean <sighs> normally I try and keep the top button going for a wee while longer you know keep it formal but this 
is starting to drag on. I can't believe you've got one of these. How come I didn't notice this when I first walked in the door? If I'd seen this when I first walked in the door, we could have had this over and done with in five minutes. You sneaky little... You know, we had a message, a report put out over Interpol. Interpol, yeah. Last week about an illegal shipment of blue yetis. I suppose you just grabbed this one up off the black market or fell off the back of a truck and I'm sure you just use it for making home videos, stuff like that, right? Ah, oh, you would never use the world's number one ASMR microphone for ASMR now, would you? I mean, oh, I've got to give it to you, you've got this and these, but these are a smoke screen, aren't they? A smoke screen for this. And it even has the fluffy thing on top. That's probably why I didn't recognize it at first you were trying to camouflage it. Sneaky. Well, I don't even know if this will fit in one of my evidence bags. What do you think? What do you think? Do you think it'll fit? It might fit. This is an incredibly rare artifact indeed. I think you're going to be going away for a long vacation. before. I mean, you've got so much crap here, I just... But yeah. What might this be? It's got some interesting markings on it. Bowl. Singing bowl. So what is it? What does it do? Just makes a... I hit it with the stick, do I? Okay. This is a trick, isn't it? I'm going to hit this ball and it's going to make some 
sound that's are you trying to manipulate me? Are you trying to manipulate me? Okay, I'll bite. I'll bite. It's okay, I've got it. Let's see. I think I... I think I understand. I think I understand. You're free to go.